here. Diana Diorofrio, her choice of car is Odamari No Passai. Also one of the little more newer katas. So the judges aren't making a comparison one with the other. Their job is to evaluate the kata against the perfect performance of kata. Yes, exactly. That's not to say viewers can't make a, form their own opinions of what they see between one and the other. So one criteria that uh, they uh, judge on uh, for the technical block, it's uh, the transitions. And I think Teriana are doing her transitions really smooth and... Uh, and, and by way of transition, it would be, for example, you wouldn't do the kick and then the step, or you wouldn't do the, the step and then a punch later. It has to happen at the right time exactly. in that transitional movement. Mm. So it's the timing also between the uh, lower part of the body and the, the upper part of the body performing the kata as a, a single unit. Yeah. Sometimes you see athletes who are performing kata make very strong upper body and, uh, and don't focus enough on their stances. That isn't the case here though. No, I think she has a really great focus on it. And uh, I think uh, her technical performance is a little bit better than the Portuguese. And uh, if you are right, then remember 70% of the performance is based on, of the weighting of 70% is on technical performance. quick I think that was a great performance of Tariana I've seen many of her performances but I think this is actually one of the better she completed the bow and that's the important part of letting the judges know that I've started you bow at the beginning and that you finished and you bow at the end and the failure to bow can result in disqualification well, let's see what the scores are and I'll ask you again in a few moments for your opinion yeah yes I I already made a hint about it during the cut a bit sure. I, uh,